All right, guys, so now we're gonna go over some tips to help you improve your bar's uh, spin. Uh, so this goes along with barbell maintenance. I like to do this every time I clean my barbells. Uh, right here, I've got an Ohio bar, which is a great barbell, but it's not really known for its immense spin, um, and neither are most Rogue bars. Usually, they're good enough, but uh, people like to see the sleeves rotate a little bit more. This one, if you you can't actually hear it, but there's a little bit of friction in there, and uh, you can kind of feel it as I'm holding on to the bar. All right, so. Some people like to take the sleeves off. I don't think that's necessary in most cases unless you have a really, really sticky barbell. Two lubricants that I like to use, uh, white lithium grease or water resistant silicone lubricant. This is the stuff that you use on your garage door. Um, the reason why you're not gonna use oil, like a WD-40, um, they'll spin pretty good for a little bit and then uh, you have the chance to attract dust. So try not to use WD-40. If you really need to, then, then go ahead and use it. I really haven't seen any bars get really sticky by using WD-40. Uh, so I'm gonna use the silicone lubricant. This varies a little bit more, or a little bit than the white lithium grease in that it's a little bit more liquid-like. So I'm just gonna spray it right into that bushing. Be careful how much you spray. Just kind of rotate it as you go along. Just kind of let it rotate. Let it rotate in there. Let it coat that bushing. So there's two bushings. There's one here and there's one here. Uh, we're just gonna attack this one for now. If your barbells, like I said, if they're really sticky, then you're gonna to wanna to take off the whole sleeve, but this barbell is relatively new, so I'm not gonna go through that. All right, so here's the sleeve that I just sprayed with that silicone lubricant. Make sure you have a rag handy because the silicone lubricant, like I said, is a little bit more liquid-like. Um, I'm just gonna give it a spin. So it spins a little bit better, um, not a huge difference, but it does feel a lot smoother, so with me holding on to the bar, I can actually feel that it's just, there's less friction in there. And that's always a good thing, so. This is the other side. I'm gonna hit the side with the white grease. Get it in there, spin it around, let it work itself in there. So this is a little bit more gel-like. It's a little bit thicker than the silicone lubricant. It's gonna leave like a white residue. Take a rag, kind of clean that up. So let's check that out. Spins pretty good. Much smoother, a little bit better. And that's all you really need to do to take care of your bars as far as the spin goes. Um, just stay on top of it. If you live in drier conditions, then the lubricant will probably dry out a little bit faster. So you're gonna have to stay on top of it more. Uh, but that's all you need to do. Don't worry about taking off the sleeve. That will probably end up voiding your warranty anyways. So just spray a little bit of white lithium grease or some silicone lubricant in it. You'll be all right. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys.